This video series will help you get the most out of SolarWinds Storage Resource Monitor. This part will cover dashboard views and customization. We will start in the Storage Summary Dashboard. This screen comes up after you've added your first storage device to monitor and is the main screen for SRM. From here, we can continue to add additional devices to monitor, learn more about Storage Resource Monitor, or remove this section and start monitoring the storage devices. We are provided a summary of information for the storage devices being monitored. The information ranges from a listing of the monitored storage devices, key performance information, capacity summaries, a summary of events, and any priority alerts that need to be addressed. The performance dashboard shows a performance summary of the monitored storage devices, storage pools, and LUNs. This includes performance information for SAN and NAS devices ranging from IOPS, latency, and throughput. The capacity dashboard provides a summary of capacity information for storage arrays, storage pools, and LUNs and volumes. Here, you can see a high-level view of your thick and thin storage pools, LUNs, and NAS volumes. In the Orion Core platform, there is the ability to customize the dashboard view and set it to provide the data that is critical to your environment. To customize the view for any dashboard, simply start by clicking Customize Page. Here, you adjust the name of the dashboard, set left navigation, add additional columns, enable knock view, and limit the view. This process can be repeated for each of the dashboards. Join us for our next video where we will dig a little deeper into specific storage object views around arrays, storage pools, and LUNs.